Welcome back to Midday Kentucky. Well, I am down in Richmond and this almost like a hidden gem Four Sisters Tea Emporium. It is so relaxing. Everything smells good. I think I'm just going to stay here. <laughs> it's beautiful. Um, Melody is the owner and her daughters, Caroline and Catherine, are with us as well. Melody, tell us a little bit. You have such a fantastic story on Four Sisters. Thank you so much. Well, we raise dairy goats here in Madison County. We take the milk and we make all natural soap, lotion, bath bombs, all kinds of beauty products. And of course, back here where we are right now, the tea room, uh, we have over 90 different kinds of certified organic loose leaf tea, and we have locally made pastries, soups and sandwiches, and all kinds of great things to eat. You have so much going on here. How did you get into this? You know, we just started making the soap uh, for our own use at home, and other people wanted it, and it just really kind of grew from there. I started a farmer's market here in town, and it just kept growing, and we are continuing to grow. Now, you were telling me before that you started with all of your bath lotions and soaps and all of that, and the tea just kind of came around because you noticed people like that kind of thing, and you started with 11, and now what do you have? We have over 90 different kinds of loose leaf tea. How are the people of Richmond? Do they come in and try new ones, or is it kind of everybody sticks to their, to their favorite? Sweet tea is huge in Kentucky. We all know that. How is breaking that? Everyone's um, a little different, but there are people who do want to try different teas, and there are others who we kind of have to pull off their shell a little bit. So one great thing that we have here is our World Tea Club, in which people get a card, and they can try a different tea every time they come in. We sign off on it, and when they try it, over 70 of our offered teas, then they are a member of the uh, tea club, they get a t-shirt, they get 15% off, and that really encourages them to just try all of what we have. So, so cool. Such a great incentive. Now, we talked about your space a little bit, but you have big news. You're moving, aren't you? That's right. So we have outgrown this space. This is just a little tiny 12-seater. And uh, so we are moving to the Richmond Mall. It's the indoor mall that's been here since 1987. And we have a space that's about three times this size. So not only will we have a lot more retail in the front part, but we're converting the back part of that space to another Four Sisters where we can do coffee, tea, and also add in a wine bar. A lot of people's ears just <laughs> perked up. I have a feeling you have people that are going to be coming in early and then staying, you know, starting with the tea, ending with some wine. Now, you raised the money in a really cool way, didn't you? How did that work? Well, we started with the Kickstarter, and actually, we really want to thank all the people in Richmond and everywhere else that really supported us because we actually did make it over our Kickstarter. So really excited to move into our new space and offer you guys everything that you've been asking for. I can't tell you how great it smells in here. Your Thank average you. customer, do they start in the beginning, get some of your homemade Kentucky? Everything's local. That's the really cool part. You grow this all on your own property here. Yes. And then make it back into the teas, which you were explaining some of your teas to me, but you offer classes as well, right? Yeah, so starting in September, we'll start back up our tea tasting and education classes. Um, we usually do about 10 different teas. We go through all different types, and you get to taste some and learn a little bit about each tea. It's the coolest thing. All right, well, thank you all for having us here. We're going to um, definitely try some things, and we've been watching everybody eat and enjoy the tea. Your information, where should people go if they want to find out how to find you? Well, we are on Facebook, Four Sisters in Richmond. We just recently changed our name because uh, one of our daughters over here, Caroline's going to open Four Sisters in Savannah, so we'll be branching out there as well. And uh, so it's Four Sisters in Richmond on Facebook and Instagram. Okay, so definitely check them out. And then one more time, when are you moving so all of your loyal customers know? We hope to be open by November 1st. Right now we are on plan. Everything's going great with the renovations. And uh, November 1st is our deadline. All right, we're excited. We will definitely be back to the new location. I know I'm coming back before then to maybe even join the tea club. It's yes. really, really cool. <laughs> Thank you all so much for having us here. Stay with us, Midday Kentucky. We'll be right back.